Hi guys, welcome to another Game Boys Raw awesome video. As you see, you know, episode of the carpet episode 87. So episode 87 is finally here. Hope you guys enjoy this one as always. Um, this one is still last year. I still got loads to bring out last year. I almost got them all, but yeah, out. But still got quite a few to bring out still. So uh, this is one I did some Bank Holiday, um, Bank Holiday weekend one. Um, yeah. It was alright. I did alright on this one. It wasn't too bad. But I enjoyed it. It was good. Um, the things I got. Got some 90s bits. 90s toys. Some random things. But you'll see anyway. Um, yeah, it's a good one. I'm happy I get this one out now. To show you guys what I got in this one. Um, yeah, so it was a Bank Holiday one. Bank holiday, I did a, did a Sunday and I did a Monday. So I Bank Holiday Monday and a Sunday. Uh, I think I even did one on a Saturday, but I didn't end up adding it into this video because I can't remember what which one it was. And maybe I've already brought it out by accident, so I don't know. But hopefully this one's alright. It's quite a long one. A few things to see, some interesting bits. And yeah, but before I get into the video, guys, I just want to say I have merch. So if anyone's interested in uh, supporting me, uh, wearing my logo or wearing some of my designs, um, I do have a design on a t-shirt at the moment. I... Apparently, it's, ugh. sadly, it's actually in the wash at the moment. I've been wearing it because it's so cool. It was designed by my friend Jake. But I, I whack a uh, thing here. You used to see me wearing it. You might have already seen it. But I should be over here somewhere um, wearing it. And, yeah, it's a Game Boy design that was created by Jake. I put his... Um, I put a thing here. It's his Instagram. Check him out. It's uh, Jake underscore artillery. So, yeah. So, check out Jake. He does some cracking work. And he did me a logo because he's an awesome guy. Not a logo, it's just a design for a t-shirt I wanted. I was wanting to change my logo, but I do actually like the one I created myself here. Um, I just really like it. Uh, but yeah, so I do have some merch. Link in the description. I have a hat I done had made. It's it's all right. Um, I try. I want to try and get it a bit better, but it looks good though. But if anyone wants a hat, it got it's got this on it. Um, the one on the store doesn't have this on it because it just ends up being too much money. I don't, I don't want people to think, oh, it's well expensive. So I've ended up taking that off, but my one has it. But all you'd be getting, if you had a hat, it would just be on here. It looks all right. I wish it could be a little bit better, but I'm happy with it. It looks good. It's my uh, all Game Boys with awesome hats. But the T-shirt is in the washer. I can't really show you what it looks like on, on video, but you can see a picture here here a picture of me wearing a t-shirt and enjoying life um so that's it that is it so i'm gonna throw the clips if you want to support my channel that'd be awesome just you know I, no, 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 if you buy one of these there's no money to me it's going to go to the company who's making them because i can't make these t-shirts so you know that's why the price is a price um they charge you how you know a little bit more when you put more graphic you know like you know images like stuff like this on um so that's why i took one off so it's only like the logo um what says game boys are awesome whatever but hopefully you guys enjoy it there's a few designs in there check them out um if you don't want to buy them i'm not bothered it's just something there people have been asking before that they want i have some merch and i thought i'd try and get some done and uh, piss around some designs so yeah that's it so hope you guys enjoy it as always see you at the end of the video bye yeah. Wait. Come out, right? Nana. Couple of good. Not right. Three. Alright, go on. Yeah, I'll go anywhere else. Oh no. How much is um is this? Uh that? Yeah. Fifty P. And uh these these are the How many you got there? Got one, two, three. Four, five. Uh, yeah, ten p. The small ones ten p. Is that what we've got? Small on the ten p. And then these big ones are 
20 or something, is it? Yeah, so I don't know. For the lot, do you want to give us a couple of quid or is that alright? Yeah, that's fine, yeah. yeah. Um, oh, yeah, you want to buy again. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, cool. Do you have your chain today? We have. Yeah. Okay, so I've got them. For a tenner? Yeah. I've got a fiver. I've got a fiver, yeah. So you want eight? Yeah. Is it a V-neck? There's a five. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Not bad for two quid, guys. A load of 90s toys, like Mighty Maxis, a few little bits and bobs. But yeah, really cool. I used to love Mighty Maxis back in the day. Basically, they're. Um, Potty pockets for boys. So Mighty Max is what they brought out back in the nineties for the boys. And um yeah, I used to have one of these as a kid. I think I had the Scorpion one as a kid. Uh, I still actually got it somewhere. But um yeah, I do come back later on and check out. Um I realise I missed out on a few bits like the little Mighty Maxes and a few bits what go in them. So I do come back later on and grab them. So awesome. <laughs> Yeah. Where are they? No, they got the goose Um, how much are your videos anyway? Uh, how many are you having? I was just looking at the goosebumps ones before. Uh, uh, quid for all three? Is that alright or? Um, I think you've got, you've got another one up there. Would you do a quid for four? Yeah, yeah, yeah. find another one. I think there's another one up there, so. There's a book there, but you're looking at videos. There's some videos up. Oh, there's a goosebumps there, look. Yeah, that's what I spotted, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, quid for yeah, I'll give four. It, yeah. Yeah, I'll give it, yeah. There you go. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, doing it. Get those. Remember, do you remember? Do you ever used to watch this? Probably a bit young for that, but a bit old, young for that. Yeah. I thought I'd definitely pick up these VHSs. I do love Goosebumps. I used to love watching them back in the day. Um, yeah, really good. So for a couple of quid, I grabbed a couple of VHSs. I don't really see Goosebump VHSs often, so I grabbed them for for a few quid. And uh, yeah, I've kept them, and I think they're quite cool. You know, brings back some memories of watching them back in the day. I think it was like on CBBC or something like that on on TV. I used to love watching them. But yeah, let's head off now to the next store. I wonder what demo that is. I don't want to call one. What's the Lego back? Got these. You see each? Just to make sure I've got that here. How much are you getting? Uh, 150 each, but yeah. if you want a few, we'll knock some money off. Yeah, it's on. Um, What would you do for the three? Uh, would that be for fifty? Um, say th do it for three pounds if you like. Yeah, I'll do that. Uh, I'll play that. No, no, I played it. There's a uh, got five. You Thank you very much. Thanks. Just 
Tuh. Youngest was into Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon you, you've got it, you can go for it. We take a pound for that as well. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. That's fine. Thank you. Put the battery in there. I didn't even know what game is that? It's a weird little dot. Okay. No, I mean the other one. It's that one. I've never heard of it. Lewis has got that. Thank you. Picked up two awesome games the PS2, or three actually, sorry. Um, I picked up a copy of Sly, which is number three and number two, I think. But sadly, uh, I think it was number two, it doesn't have the disc in which is annoying. You'll see in a minute I opened up I didn't realise and it hasn't got a disc. You'll see right now, so really annoying, but oh good. Yeah, I, I think I've got number one I picked up and I haven't got these two. I don't know, I think they're the, um, the Australian version, but... Oh man, that was missing disc, but it's alright for a case, isn't it? Has that got it? That one's got the disc in it. That one's missing. But at least I can grab a disc or something like that. Mm -hmm. Come on. Mm -hmm. That's there, isn't it? Yeah, How much um, are all these little, uh, little bit? For everything, I don't know, a quid? Yeah, I'll do that. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. I'm still out of the bag. Okay. Uh, I should have a little quid somewhere. There you go. Thank, Thank you. you. Came back, had a little dig through the box again just to make sure, and I got a few extra bits that I did actually miss out on for the uh, Mighty Maxes. So I grabbed those for a pound, really can't go wrong with that. So I really like seeing stuff like this. This brings loads of so much nostalgia seeing like really old 90s toys and uh, things I used to have as a kid. And to see that, that was really good to uh, make an awesome video. Look at that dodgy. You need to work a bit in there or not? No. How much is this? 50 Yeah, I get it. <laughs> um, that was like the randomest thing I've ever seen. Such a weird Mario toy. It's completely bootleg, like it's so fake. But I thought I'd grab it just for 50p. So yeah, why not? Well guys, it's time to pick up. So yeah, let's go show you what I got today. I didn't think I'd find anything today, but I actually found some nice stuff. So yeah, which I'm pretty happy with. So today, I'll show you some games first actually. 
Uh, hopefully, I think I did get these on video, pretty sure, but if not, then I'm sorry. But yeah, I got some good games. The first ones I'll show you last. Oh, they're really good ones. Oh, you've already seen anyway, but you know anyway. Um, I got Jack and um, Jack Free, which I've already got, but I've got this one. Um, it's complete, um, which is nice. I got this one because it has the in the the DVD included with it, which is like an extra bit, and it still had that in it. So, which is nice. It's complete with manual. So I got that because it's complete with manual and the demo disc, which is like a demo or some DVD thing. It says that on the side there, and which yeah, I'm, I'm happy to have that because I've already got this game anyway. But yeah, I thought I'd grab it for that. It's not really worth a lot, but I got it for a quid. These two games are awesome. I got these two from the same guy. These are quite pricey games, and I haven't got them. I think I might have one of them, but I might not have number two. But I've, I've, it's not in there sadly. I've got number three, which is complete, as you can see, um, with manual and disc, nice condition too. Pan for that one, and I got this one, which after I bought it, I didn't realise it had no no. Oh, sorry, I didn't check them because I was very happy I found them. They didn't have a disc in it, which is a shame. Um, yeah. A game that I've been wanting to get. I don't know if I've got this. I don't know if it's this one I've got. Or if I've got the um, number one. I don't know. So, but yeah. Hopefully I have number two already. And it's number one that I needed. So, yeah. I think I do need I think I do need this one. I don't think I've got number one already. So, oh well. But hopefully I can get a disc for that. Someone may still a disc for it. Um... First of all, I've got some really nice stuff from. I thought I'd definitely grab. I don't know what else I missed on that store. She had some really cool items. Um, so yeah, I've got, le got left with the leftovers. But yeah, I've got some unusual things. Um, I've got some Mighty Maxes, um, which are quite cool. I'm not sure what go in the, inside these bits. But uh, yeah, I've got Mighty Max which are like little potty pocket things for like girl, boys I mean sorry I used to have one as a kid I had the scorpion no did I have a scorpion or was that a hand my, me and my brother had one my, I think I had the scorpion as a kid and uh, my brother got a weird hand one um, yeah they were quite cool you know um, so I had one of those, those as a kid I've got another one here, it's like a dragon, but suddenly the logo has come off it. Is it a dragon or like a snake? A lizard? It's missing his hand as well, that's like part of his hand there. But, yeah. Is that a part of his hand? I don't know what it is. Yeah, looks like it is. A little claw is missing. I'm not sure, I may have it in there, but, yep. Yeah, I did try and grab all the little bits I thought may go with them, because you don't know, you know, random bits. So I got that one as well. Um, I've got a Polywell, you know, didn't pay much for him. Um, all these little bits, I don't know if they go with it. I really don't know what these some of these are for. That go with it, there's like some sort of. So these things are like, they're awesome, but like. So many bits you could lose some because you you don't know if it's meant to go in there with them. Not sure that's part of it or not. Does that go? I don't know. But I've got loads of little bits which I wasn't sure if they're part of any of these. Actually, is that that could be it. Yeah, I think, is that it? Is that his hand? Yeah, I think I got it. I think that's his hand, because it goes with it. Does it go a bit further in or anything? Yeah, that's awesome. So, yeah, he has got his hands. I did find it in the box, which is nice. So he's got his hand, he just hasn't got his little logo. So, yeah. You have to make sure that you get these little guys. Um, 
I just got the ones that I thought looked like Marty Max's. I'm not sure. I think this is from a Marty Max, but I don't know if it's from this big guy. I wasn't sure if he went in here and there was like a little fire in it. Yeah, he must do because he's got like um, it matches exactly the same colour as him. Maybe some sort of put him somehow in there. I really don't know. Maybe it goes in there. That's definitely part of it because it's exactly the same colour as him. I'm going to put, it in, put him inside, put it inside him. And there's a little fire guy, I don't know who he meant to go in there. There's so many little bits. Um, I've got this weird one as well, a little small one. A very really small one. Paid next to them, they're out these up for 20p each. You don't really, you know, I don't see Mighty Maxes often. This is missing some pieces. I didn't really try and grab everything to do with Mighty Max, what I knew of. There may have some, there may have some more bits in there, I don't know. Yeah, there you go. Mighty Max with a, with a green hat and Mighty Max with a red one. I'm not sure where to put I'm going to put him in the snake, the, the lizard or whatever. The lizard one's really cool, I really like him. Put him inside there. I do love these little guys, like the detail and all that is awesome. They must have more somewhere. What's all I may have brought them? But yeah, really cool little guys. Um, not sure what that. That's definitely from a Mighty Max or something. Is that part of this one again? Right, purple. I don't know. I'll be here for hours trying to figure out where it goes, what, what goes where. So I'll put them on the floor for now. As well I got from them, I got some Goosebumps DVD videos. They had a few other video or videos that were quite cool, but yeah, I wasn't really wanting them. Um, they, had video, they had the books as well, for the books as well. But I prefer the videos, like them, them and the kid. Um, something book comes to life. Um, I think it says it includes includes three inside. Oh, it's in there. Oh, no, no. Got a poster when you buy the, the video. Three horror card. So I've got four of them for a pound. I think it was a fair price. Um, three. Bookmark, bookmark, but that won't be in there. But yeah, I got three, three or four, sorry, um, goosebumps videos. I think that's the first time I've ever come across videos. Um, I've always seen box, but I do prefer, you know, I do like watching these. So this is actually like a quite a long one, I think, the one with the mask. Yeah, there's some really classics there uh, from back in the day. I used to love watching them. Um, as well, from the same person, I got this toy. I don't, it's way before me, um, well, way before me, but like, I never really watched it. But it's that weird look, I recognise him from something. Because it's Disney, actually, I didn't realise it was Disney. Some weird, like, monsters. Um, original Power Ranger. Um, 1993 um, missing his sword but yeah he could probably do in better in condition but yeah he's all there um, a yo-yo for 10p or got it in a bundle um, one of the old ones back in the day clutch ones I think it's one of the originals so I got that 
I don't know what else they would have bought. They would have bought some other cool stuff about what I missed out on. Um, a Call of Duty, I thought I'd get. And this is from someone else as well. This is probably the weirdest item ever. I've seen stuff like this before. It's basically like a fake Mario, but it's a Mario kids toy. Um, but like fake as hell. So really random. It hasn't got the bottom, sadly, it's been snapped off. But yeah, 50p, random. I probably wouldn't have got it if it was a quid because I didn't really need it. But I mean, I think it's just play songs and stuff with a little weird Mario on it. So that's it, guys. So tomorrow will be another one. So it'll be Bank Holiday Monday. I, forgot, I completely forgot it's Bank Holiday um, tomorrow. So yeah, me and Lewis are going to hit up another car boot. As you would have seen, he was here with me today. Um, so yeah, today wasn't. It was. It wasn't the best, it really wasn't, um, well, I've got some okay things you've seen, but hard any stalls, man, it's like, I, sometimes I wish to stay in bed, but I'm happy that I've got some games to the collection, so that one game, I'm really happy, you know, um, the rest of the bits, I don't know, maybe going to move on, I did get this little, um, this guy, I think he's worth some money. I used to have him at Hab one as a kid from 1997, eight. So my my uncle gave me one of these, and um, they basically tells you um, this little piggy went to the market. And this little piggy stayed home. This little piggy had oh. <laughs> This little piggy had rose. And then, and this little piggy went wee wee. <laughs> wee, wee. <laughs> oh, wee. Yeah, that was a uh, pound 50p. <laughs> Pound, I think. So, and he, and he, and he rubber, when he laughs, it, he vibrates. Um, I still got my original one from when I was a kid, but I think he may be worth some money. So, I'm going to put him on eBay, see if I can get anything back from him. Put it for like £10 or not, see what happens. I'm not desperate to, you know, I'm not really wanting him, but it's good that it's got batteries in it still and it still works. So thanks you guys for coming along again today, um, hopefully this has been joined on to the one that I did yesterday, if not then yeah hopefully it will be, and um, yeah give it always, as always as I said before give me a thumbs up to let me know that you enjoyed the video, um, and yeah I'll see you tomorrow, so hopefully tomorrow brings in some good stuff, it's going to be raining actually soon, about 10 o'clock it says it's going to rain today, um, so yeah hopefully it doesn't get too wet and then tomorrow won't be cancelled or anything like that meant to be nice tomorrow i've looked i'm on google um so fingers crossed it goes well um the other bits and bobs so yeah thanks a guys and i'll see you guys in a bit peace out yo so i did up the second car boot which was actually a bank holiday monday one so let's head off to the bank holiday monday Do you do four quid for five? You do four pounds for five of them? Because that one's got the wrong game, that's all. It's just, that one's got the wrong, it's just like the wrong case for the wrong game. You do four pounds? Yeah. yeah. Um, you got any change? Thanks very much. A few titles here. I got them for, as you see, four pound. You know, they're nothing great. The cases are pretty naff. I did pick up one game which actually is a Crash Bandicoot case, but the game wasn't even Crash Bandicoot in it. But I thought I'd grab them up. 
Yeah, why not? Just for a couple of quid. What gig is that one? Four, that's not bad. Thank you. Lewis picked up an iPod for only a quid. Can't go wrong, really. You know, quid for an iPod. I think it was a four gig when he said, and it did fully work actually, but for only a quid. You know, I do pick up them, pick them up, and add them to the collection, but I've already got that one, so yeah, let them have it. Yeah, okay. fucking multi mega for two pounds. <laughs> You know what I'm all mega is, and you've seen it, it's like basically a mega CD and a mega drive in one. Like really small. Really cool. Like compact. Another. Is that like a surround sound? Yeah, it's what they changed into, the sound bar, isn't it? <laughs> How much are your games? They're a quid each or three for a two quid. Okay. You yeah. can mix and match with CDs or You do 150 with that and that, because that's just a, de a demo, isn't it? It says, yeah. Uh, yeah, go on. Yeah. <coughs> Alright, well, doing too bad for PS1 games today to see he picked up these other two PS1 games one was really minty or these ones actually were quite in this nice condition I got them pretty much the cases one of them I kept the other one which was um I'll, you see in a minute in the video I'll tell you what I did um but yeah a couple games there I can't go wrong <laughs> Tetris that's pretty cool I don't get it. Get the, get the key ring. Is it? I'm the key ring man. Nineteen ninety-six. <laughs> What's that? Taser. Taser. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. How much is this as well? Uh, quid. Quid. Uh, yeah, okay. Got that as well. So. Thank you very okay. much. Not very, not very good ones. These ones, but another one for you. Lewis spotted a Tetris keyring game, which he gave me. He let me have that. It's only twenty p, and I got it's really enough virtual pet if anyone sees these at the car boot don't even buy them they're so rubbish they're like the worst programming ever been put on a time i got to your virtual pet so don't ever get them i got this one because it was sealed yeah. just for i think it was a pound but why not oh, yeah disney what no. 
Oh, that's well cool, look. Yeah. Puff will come out of him. <laughs> because that's, that's what happens, isn't it, when you're getting wet? How much, how much is it? Oh, 25p. Pounds, if I've got them. Um, what are these? Bit, lost an arm there. Um, I've got a pound left. There you go, thank you. That's well cool, isn't it? It, com it comes out. There's loads of them in there. Look. That's pretty sick. I'm keeping that. That is awesome. This has got to be the best gizmo or gremlins plush I've ever picked up. It is so cool that like, little gizmos pop out of them. So cool. Awesome, awesome. How much is your uh, old dip? Eight pounds. Eight pounds. It's in the car. Yeah, an old. Yeah. And all the all the fittings. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
the decks are cracked or anything, but I paid three quid for this. I didn't even haggle. Um, it's nice. It, this this actually wobbles, but I can probably do it up and set it on for a bit if I yeah set it up. I've, I've got quite a few screws. I may build it. I, I do like the colour of this day. I like how it's got like cracks and stuff into it. Looks pretty sick. So yeah, that one I got for three pound. Oh, and then I just hit the roof of my car, but I haven't damaged it, so that's all tasty. Um, so now let's go off to the second car boot, which was a load better, um, but still wasn't amazing. Didn't get in this on video, or did I? I don't know. I might have got me with buying them, I don't know. Like, but I got a really cool uh, micro sub RC thing, which is unusual, we've never seen it so far, so. Yeah, I thought I'd grab that. That was a quid. Oh, this is wicked. Really happy of picking up this. Uh, one of the coolest plushies to do with gremlins. Um, and that is uh, this really cool gizmo. Um, basically, inside him he has little gizmos, which, you know, if you get them wet, they pop out. Which is insanely awesome, because I've never seen one like this before. So you've got one little gizmo just come out like little heads looks like so you've got one there uh, two so you get two little guys in there what fit inside him and what year is this from is this oh it's from gremlins 2 gremlins 2 1991 wow so it's official um so really really cool having that that's gonna be uh definitely in my room and enjoyed because I, I love gremlins i might have to i might have to watch it soon again because i've not watched it for a few years or maybe not probably a few years maybe a year or so so yeah put him put these little guys back in here but they're really cool i've never seen that before i'm trying to get them back in so you can actually close it up that's what you want to be able to do but yeah, he's not closing up, I'll probably have to put him in a different way. But that's really cool, so he's awesome. He's going to be kept. Um, I did get a Sony Walkman, which was a bust. I thought, I was thinking of taking it back, I paid three quid for it. But, yeah, it's got battery leakage. But uh, I'm thinking I could actually clean it up. And maybe sell, sell, sell it, I don't know. But it is so bad in there. It's one of the worst I've seen, but it's even on the spring as well. But I'm going to try and clean it up, as I said. Um, just see what I can do with it. The outside of it is amazing condition, but the inside is awful. But, yep, three quid, I thought I'd give that a go. I got some PS1 stuff, which I've not picked up PS1 stuff in a while, actually. So it's nice to actually pick some more up. Um, none of these games I think I need, um, which I think I may need Peter Pan because I'm collecting them for the PlayStation 1 and I'm collecting them for Disney. I might need Peter Pan, I don't know. So I've got Peter Pan, um, which is complete uh, with manual and everything, so that's Peter Pan. Um, I've got this one just for case because it's not the best game in the world. Um, Rainbow Six, I'm not, and the case is an amazing dish. And the reason why I bought it as well, I'll show you. I picked up this one as well, which was, what was this one? I think it was a quid. Or, you know, 150 I picked that up with someone else. Um, so I got those ones, from, well, that's from a different guy. Um, I don't know what it is, yeah. I picked up this one, which was just a case um, back of Crash Bandicoot 3, but it, it's missing the disc as well. But I do actually have, I don't think I had the Platinum one for it, but yeah. I thought I'd get that because that's always worth grabbing. A football game looked interesting. Um, I don't not really pick up football games, but this looked quite different. Like sort of, different sort of style of football games, so got that one so that's interesting 
Um, yeah, I thought I'd get that. And the reason why I got that other mint case, that's um, other case, is because I got. Um, sadly, it's a bit, you know, battered, but I've got a copy of Toy Story 2 complete, but it needs a new case. So I, I bought that. A really nice case for it to give it a bit more fresh look. Um, I'm not sure this game's any good, but um, I got that one as well. So I've got those two, um, and then I got a demo disc which is here, which I thought I'd grab as well. Um, they always people collect them, but I'm not really into getting them. But I'm not sure what this may have come with, so I don't know if it's meant to come with a console. Um, and I think that's it what I've got. I've, I've got a bag. Oh no, it's not what it is. I've got this Gamester bag. Um, Gamester LM, LMP bag, which is quite cool. Not sure where it's from, but um, I've got this cassette player which actually is working. Let's have a actually look. I've got my headphones somewhere here. It's a Sony one. Actually playing. Working. I think the batteries are pretty much dead. It's a stop, but I think the batteries have uh, have died and gone to heaven. So yeah, really cool though, and yeah, for, that was two pounds. So the last thing I got, guys, is a really cool portable video player, which is insane. I paid eight quid for it. Um, the guy apparently paid £400 back in for it, which I actually believe him because these things are really expensive when they're new. But I've never seen one like this. Um, looks like, I, I may, I don't know, I, do I need to keep this? I don't know. But it is really cool. It's actually still got a video in it. So we can actually test it with a video. It's got, is it the mummy or something in there? Um, but I've got all the cables so I can actually test it out. I'm going to test it in my car because it's meant to be for the car. So, yeah, this looks really cool. Like, you've got sound there, thinking it. And I've got all the cables in there as well, which are at the bottom. But we'll get, we'll get that out. Let's try it out. Let's see if this works. I'll plug that in one of these. Plug that in there. Turn it on. Where's my, where's my car keys, car keys. So this was eight quid. I got from the same guy I got the Sony Walkman from. And we're gonna see if this works. Oh, crappy music playing. We're not even plugged this in yet. Let's have a look. Nothing on the screen at the moment. Oh! Oh! I know what that film is. That is going to be. Um, that's going to be um, Mouse Hunt. Let's check, that's mouse on it, I reckon it is. Oh, that's where it is. I've got a contrast for the screen. I couldn't even see the screen. Mouse on Awesome. Let's try that again. Let's have a look what this does. Hello. Hello. Right. Yeah. Oh, it does work. 
It works. I mean, you guys want to see this. It's very dull, but as you can see. I love Lee Evans. Lee Evans awesome. He's one of my favourite comedians. And that film's great. And a wicked film inside. I love the, you know, that film. So that is insanely awesome. So it's got one for the tea, one for here, and one for actually at home. So you can actually play it at home. So you've got one you can play in the car, the cable, and then you've got this one. So very, very cool. Um, so it was eight quid. I looked on eBay before I bought this and someone sold one for £50 of £8 postage. So I may whack it on eBay or I may send it to a friend who does love VHSs and stuff like that. I think he this be something up his street. So we'll work out a deal with that and help him out. But this yeah, is really cool. It's got two headphone jacks as well. Two headphone jacks. Uh, so you can play, which so for the kids can watch it, and it's even got a um, ports to put like other things into it, so video, uh, video in, video and audio in, and stuff like that. So that means you could probably put your PlayStation something on it, which is wicked. So that would have been. He said he got this early two two thousand one. So yeah, I would have been like twelve. 11, 11, I would have been 11, 2001. So this would have been pretty cool having this as a kid. Um, so, yeah. Very nice piece of kit. For the price I thought I'd grab that. I've just never seen it. I always see like the video ones, or the DVD ones, but I never see the VHF ones, so. Very unusual. So thanks a lot for watching guys. That is everything I got today. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it and you can see me okay and enjoyed me pissing about with a fucking VHS player. But yeah, that's it for this weekend. So I did three car boots. Um, first car boot last yesterday was, was here again, which wasn't too bad. I got a few bits, nothing really amazing. Um, the second car boot, as I see, was crap. Didn't even get any footage because there's no point. And this car boot, yeah, it was uh, a lot better. Not as disappointing. Um, the other car boot I went to today was only on every bank holiday and um, there's pretty much like more of people selling horse stuff which is because it's actually at a uh, like a horse place people do horse riding so that's probably why people who go there know about it so it's just full of horses stuff and saddles and stuff like that combs for horses but there wasn't any there was like one game that I looked at which was actually uh, missing a disc which was uh, GTA 5 for the Xbox 360 um, I don't know what the value of that is at the moment but yeah that was not anything good but uh, yeah that's it guys so yeah Lewis got a few I don't know what did Lewis get did he get any games today he, he got a book he got a couple of weird things but that's it really but yeah thanks guys and I'll see you in the next one bye Welcome back guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. As you saw, I've got something pretty nifty, which is, you've already, I, won't, I won't get it out, but do I need to show you again? I've spent ages looking in the pickup video of me looking at the video, the portable video, video uh, the portable video player. Um, that was pretty cool. I, I've still got it, I kept it, still got the Goosebump videos, still got the Mighty Maxes, uh, I used to love those as a kid. Um, still got pretty much most of that stuff. Did they even get rid of any of it? I don't think I even have. I just still got those pretty cool games and sadly one was missing a disc, which was very annoying. Um, I still got the games. I just hopefully can find another disc for it. I think they were in, um, they were actually in America, the American. They were actually the Australian versions, but I'm still happy to have them. I just need to get a disc. I think it was disc um, for the number two. Um, but I'm pretty happy to have those. I finally got, all three of them just need a disc for number two, so it's not really all three of them, just half complete. Uh, I don't know what I'm on about, I'm just talking ron nonsense now because I like to do it. It's just like you run across the street, you run across the floor. I don't know what I'm talking about because I just want to open my door to walk out this room now because I'm looking like a right dick just talking random because that's me. I'm just being myself, like I'm, I'm so like weird right now you're probably thinking i might just press that 
button and just think, I never want to watch this guy again. I don't know what I'm on about. Can someone help me? I thought, uh, help me, help, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm making this video sound like a really weird one. If you stuck by this video this long, you must have some, you must be a, a true fan. If you haven't, you must have thought, what the hell is this dude on about? And I'm just like, I don't know. I'm going to leave it here because I'm being a right weirdo now. Because that's just what I do, mate. If you enjoyed this video, as always, please get a thumbs up. Because it makes me know that you like the video. And I really want to know if you like it. And if you want to whack a comment, it's always a little section just down here which says comment. And then place that comment and let me know what you think. And I will get back to you as soon as I think about the world. But anyway, that's it, guys. Thank you a lot, guys. I appreciate you guys waiting for this new one. Um, hoping to do some more booties soon and get them out. And then we can get all the episodes from last year out out of the way because they're really driving me mad now. I want to get into the new ones. And then we can enjoy those. So see you a bit, guys. Thanks for watching my weird video today. This is a bit odd. Just me being strange. And let me know if you think you will want to see one of all. I don't know what I'm at, but yeah, shut up. Right, bye. Bye. Bye, 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 bye.